Hello, Gamer Gnome is back. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to get the chip in order to start the Doe Awakening Raid. But before we start, you can show your support by using Star Code Gamer Gnome when purchasing your Robux. With every purchase you make, 5% will go to me, and this will really help me make better videos for each and every one of us. Where the Echo Slam! Oh, they're yes. dancing forward! There's your slam! There's the dunk! Okay, so finally, update 17. Point three is out. So before we start awakening our doe fruit, let me first try buying. Hopefully we get the leopard fruit. Oh no guys, we got the chop fruit, but it's fine. At least it looks better, right? Okay, so moving on to the third sea. We have a new island and that island is the chocolate land. But we will head to the cake land first and I'm gonna show you a door. Okay, this, this door will play a big part. I'm getting the chip later, so it's located here. There we go, the door is located here. Okay, so we will be opening that door. And in order to open that door, we need something. Okay, so now we will head to the new island, the chocolate island. There we go, and there's an NPC here. Shout out to Tom, shout out to Zen, and shout out to Ace for helping me grind. Also to my brother. There you go. Okay, so with this NPC, he will ask for something. Okay, the sweet crafter will ask for a god's chalice and conjured cocoa so guys where can you get the cocoa conjured cocoa you need to defeat the mobs we get it here the cocoa warriors and the cocoa bar battlers so I, I i did not know if you can grind it on the other side of the island because there are different mobs there but just focus here okay so i started grinding this mob so as you can see they're they're not that hard to defeat just don't get hit use observation hockey so guys, check this out as proof, okay? Oh, by the way, I'm using the Hollow Sight, the one that I unlocked on my previous video. Wait for it, wait for it, and there it is, the Conjured Coco. Okay, so next up, the God's Chalice. So how can you get it? Oh, by the way, you can locate it here. We have a new inventory. It really looks cool. There you go, there you go, okay? So for our next goal, you need the God's Chalice, right? God's Chalice, so where can you get it? Three ways. First is head to the sea castle. Look for the elite hunter. There you go. Elite hunter. So he will give you a quest and you need to defeat them. So this, for example, Urban is in the port. You need to look for him there. Guys, they spawn every 10 minutes. So if you defeat them, there is a chance that you will get a god chalice. So is that it, Gamer Nom? Guys, there are other two ways to get it. <clears throat> the other one is you can head in the haunted castle. There you go, and pray, okay? Pray on the gravestones. So there's a chance that you can get one here, okay? So is that it, Gamer Nom? For those who will say that you can get it on the Death King. No! No! One more thing, if you stayed in a server for four hours, you can get it in one of the chests, randomly, okay? So once you collect all the items, go back to the Sweet Crafter and he will Make your God's Chalice candy. There you go. Coco God's Chalice or whatever you call it. Okay? So now just head to the Sea of Treats. Remember guys, the first island. And you need to summon Doe Master. Okay? Doe Master. So how do you summon him? Check it here. You need to defeat 500 mobs. Okay? In this island. In this island only. Okay? So there you go. We're gonna fast forward it. Guys, avoid dying. Check this out. I almost died. See that guys? Oh! <laughs> so I decided to change. Yes, Buddha fruit. Okay, so there you go. Let's fast forward this. Let's say we defeat 500. You can summon it. Guys, make sure that you're holding the chalice. And there you go. You will not be fighting the Doe Master, but you will be fighting the Doe King. 2300 raid boss. So Gamer no is easy to defeat. Guys, if you're planning on defeating him one on one, Unless you're using Buddha fruit and gold fruit, uh, race, I think it is possible. But if you're not using it, guys, good luck. Gamer Nom, is it okay to die? Yes, as long as there's time, you can go back and defeat him. Guys, if you're planning to, again, one-on-one -on -one this boss, check this out, my HP. See that? Just two combos. Check that HP out. <laughs> guys, I died three times here because uh, we talked about me last hitting the boss. So I really got frustrated. There you go. But we got the items needed. 
So, you will get a key here. I also obtained the mirror fractal. There you go, the red key. You will use this key in order to open the door here. The one that I showed you in the start of the video. There you go. And now you can buy the dough chip. Okay? So now, once you buy the dough chip, you will head... Wait, wait, wait. Let's get our dough fruit first because we are gonna awaken our dough fruit. Okay, so now head to the castle on the sea and you can now start the raid. Okay. So guys, check this out. Check this out. I just finished this, this video. If you're watching it now, I just finished it like uh, less than an hour ago. So remember, the developers uh, tried to close the server. We'll fix some bugs. Check this out, guys. One minute and we're still in the raids. <laughs> so guys, there you go. I'm gonna show you the full raid in two times speed. So gamer gnome, I have a question. Can a, uh, what do you call this, a Buddha fruit user awaken carry us in a raid? Yes. Oh, by the way, before I end this video, I want to thank Sanon, Zion, Tom, Ace for helping me in this update. So we're not yet finished, but I really want to thank them because it's really hard uh, trying to unlock stuff in the update alone. Okay, so without them, I won't be able to finish this one. And also, the succeeding quests, like for example, the CDK, there's Dual Katana, the God Human. So we, I will be unlocking everything. So make sure to watch out for that. Also, guys, again, the Leopard Fruit. So far, I think I'm I'm in level uh, 500 now. <laughs> Do you believe that? Okay, guys, so here it is. We are in island number four. So guys, I thought I think uh, the developers already posted that they will be shutting down the server in ten minutes. Okay, during uh, during the Do King fight. So here I'm kind of pressured because what if it shuts down? So I will be wasting the efforts of everyone. Imagine guys, we're still killing mobs, and they posted that. 10 minutes to go I still have the chalice the candy chalice okay there you go guys they posted two minutes to go before they shut down and we are still on is this a fifth oh, yeah the fifth island so we only have two minutes to defeat the boss so do you think that's enough yes I think that's enough to defeat the boss and if you notice guys it's glitching see the guys it's kind of glitching also, I didn't help the team much here because there's a high chance that my character might die. <laughs> go. One minute to go, guys. One minute to go. Okay. So, guys, are you excited with the leopard fruit? I am excited with it. I'm gonna show it to you. Check this out. I almost died. Ah. But again, thanks to my friends. Okay, we're about to finish it. Alright, where is it? Okay, so here it is. Oh, I'm not hitting it. Uh, okay, guys. So, for our first skill, and the server is shutting down the missile jab. Don't worry, I will post a full showcase of it, okay? So again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you all. See you later, guys.